Queen's Elizabeth Fry talked to a family who witnessed the exposure and festival organizers who say it should never have happened. For the past several years, Amanda Soares has made the trip from Claremont down to Tampa to enjoy the Bay Area Renaissance Festival. I feel like you kind of just jumped into another world, and that's what's fun. Soares was excited to have her son and parents tag along for this year's festivities. You expect to see the costumes and, uh, of course, as Mandy mentioned, the food, and uh, you're in another world. It's not hard to get lost in the fair's magical atmosphere, but it was the cheers coming from a nearby stage that caused Soares and her family to stop in disbelief. As I'm filming, uh, they're cheering and cheering. They come around. This one came around, swirled around, danced. Then he bent over and lifted up his kilt. And uh, there's his backside saying hello. And then you're seeing other body parts also shaking around. The show is part of the Men in Kilts competition. It's advertised on Facebook telling guests they're in for a treat. However, this is far from the show Soares and her son were expecting to see. I'm there with my 13 year old. He's a little bit older, but still super embarrassing. He kind of gave me a look like, whoa, what is happening on the stage over there? Despite the crowd's cheers, some people can be seen shielding their eyes or turning away. Soares and her father claiming they were given no warning. He was the fourth or fifth person that was trying to show what was under his kilt and everyone's cheering. With Renfest advertised as a family-friendly event, there are obvious concerns. It was definitely a 21 and over show. That even if you're 21 and over, you would want to make a decision whether or not you wanted to attend. So Ari is just hoping this disturbing display can be addressed and Renfest can go back to the family fun atmosphere she's grown to love. It's a really great time, so I would just hope that they could do something about this show. Elizabeth Fry, Fox 13 News. And Fox 13 News reached out to organizers of the Bay Area Renaissance Festival, informing them of the guests' concerns. And they told us the men in the competition are also guests at the fair, and they had no idea the man intended to flash the crowd. They said they are deeply sorry to anyone who witnessed the event.